in Griffith Park. Is the DOA dead? Dead on arrival. How can you work with him without laughing? You must be like telling jokes all the time yeah. and... No. Nope. Or you're like... Mm -hmm. I'm serious. usually sleep. No, it's a hard job. We got like 15 hours, you know, our days are 15 hours, so it's not like... We spend all of our energy between action and cut. Yep. Because it requires quite a bit, you know. Um, I mean, we'd love to say that it's just, you know, pinatas and, you know, champagne, but it's, it's just, it's, 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 it's a grind, and we want it to be great. shines through. We I can think see we, that. We genuinely like each other. You know, I've seen handle hits better than you did yesterday. Right? Suck I mean, that was the biggest nerve I think I've yeah, ever seen. Yeah. You're the biggest crybaby I've ever met in my life. Yeah, man. I'm going to suck this I mean, how does it feel to only be in the game because you're yeah, yeah, yeah. And then we also know that if we if if we want this thing to work, then we have to connect in the scenes, and yeah. it's kind of bleeding over into, you know, our mutual um, admiration and trust. Now it's starting to bleed over into the characters, and it's it's fun. It's fun. I've seen a lot of crazy people before, but this dude is in a class by himself. Who is it? Nobody. It's um. Hi, Martin Riggs. I'm sure you've heard a lot about me. Yeah, I agree. I mean, I think we, I think initially it was just we, um, we both have in common um, a respect for family, um, for our faith, and for one another. And then I think once we got into it, we realized that it was us against the world in some sense, you know, because they stick our faces all over the place, thankfully, uh, gratefully. And, but at the end of the day, it all kind of rides on us. So it's our job to make sure that one another, um, we're hitting the notes, that we're, he helps me with comedic timing. Uh, he helps me with acting. I try to help, you know, with some of the dramatic side, you know, um, but it, ultimately we just, we want the show to be great and we want each other to be great. Um, and, and that's kind of our main goal each and every day. And through that, a brotherhood naturally forms, doesn't it? We don't need a personal relationship. Let's keep it professional. But on the job, we gotta work together like surf and turf. Cool. I'm turf. No, you're surf, because you live butt naked on a beach. But it is fine between, that you guys have a good time, between shooting. Yes. Yes. Yeah, I mean, look, we like to make each other laugh. And look, when you've been working, you know, for 15 hours a day for four days in a row, uh, and then you get to that last Friday, and they tell you it's gonna be an 18-hour day, you gotta laugh to keep from crying. Right? Yeah. So we, we, we definitely find ways to keep it keep it light. When I was watching uh, the last episodes, I was thinking, mm -hmm. I can see a lot that you want to be him and you want to be him. It's like you guys want That's to have qualities mm -hmm. from each other. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Um, in real life, what kind of qualities would you like to have from him and vice versa? I personally, and I try to get this from, from D at work, I, I, when we're together, is his knowledge of the business. Um, he's been, he's, I've been doing this for 20 years, but he's been successful for 30 years, right? And that's a big difference, you know? How does it feel to only be in the game because you're I've, I've always just been climbing the mountain, and um, so I, I, I'd love to have his experience and knowledge of how to navigate this world. I don't get nothing from him. <laughs> no, no I, I, scabies. I, I, I gave him scabies one time. He used my blanket. Yeah, I said, "Don't use my blanket." Yeah, no, scabies. no I, I, I love his approach to the work. Mm -hmm. I mean, he's like super committed. Get somebody in here with a walkie and shut him the up. Or 
mean, we're not paying for this place. If we did, shoot him the up. And you know, he has a, um, a great foundation as a as a dramatic actor. You know, which I'm totally lacking in. And uh, and I also love how he. If it's not wrong, right, he's gonna stop it and make it right. I'll tend to just go ahead with the flow and let them worry about it. <laughs> editing. <laughs> he goes, no, 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 something's wrong, and he just takes control. And and I and I love that. I really appreciate that. Yeah, hey, you want to see crazy? I'll tell you. <laughs> now that's a real badge. I'm a real cop, and this is a real fucking gun. Do you think? Mr. Mel Gibson and Danny Glover are watching. No. Why not? I would imagine, I don't watch TV. You know, I've got a family and, um, you know, bigger fish to fry than just to sit down and just watch TV, you know? So I, I can't imagine. <clears throat> maybe they watched the first episode, you know, or maybe they've seen it. I think what they've done know. is they've T voted and they just haven't had time. I haven't had time to watch right. it. It's like it's full. It's the disc is full right now with Lethal Weapon episodes. Did you guys have any prior contact with them before starting? We did a, a TV, uh, um, like an award show, and we saw Mel, and he went. <laughs> he gave, yeah, it, he gave yeah. us like the, uh, yeah, yeah, you know, yeah. the uh, thumbs up. But I don't know what that meant. And that was it. And he could have been doing that to the guy behind me. Right. I'm, I'm, not, <laughs> yeah. I'm, not completely, I'm not completely sure it was towards my direction, so. No, that's not it. I can never sleep in my bed again. <laughs> Why not? I don't want to be anywhere where you and mom had sex. Then you better get off that couch. <laughs> my wife and kids, oh my God, this show is, to this date, is in Brazilian television. I know, I was just over in Rio. Look at Michael Caio. You were there when? Uh, just about a month ago, mm -hmm. right after Carnival, it was epic. Oh yes, yeah. Went to Bagatelle. On that note, thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. What the hell did this guy do? We questioned him. The right. guy right. fled, so we followed and, him at a safe distance. And then he pulled distance. a gun on us. Yes, right. and he pulled a gun. Tried what to shoot. What are we going to do? We pulled Stop! a gun. Stop! You were 50 years old, Murtaugh, and still only a detective. I like solving cases, not kissing asses. <laughs>